Okay, so he just gave us a mission to move on. The city and the stars. So Phineas has an associate who can help you locate Minister Clark. This person works at the Byzantium docks. That was Carmen Imagawa. And then the weapons from the void. We just got, we acquired his weapon. Now there's still one in the abandoned lab. There's one on Monarch. There's one on Scylla. So we'll have to work on those. And we have a few other missions we can do here too. Um, Slaughterhouse Clive. Scarcity of salt tuna alternatives on Monarch. Clive Lumberg has been making a killing by operating the planet's last remaining Borst factory. So this one's for Sublight. Oh, right. Yeah, she wanted me to uh, mess him up. What was her name? This was a bad one. Let me look at these real quick. Okay, so there's two here on Roseway that we didn't finish up. We got to do that some point soon. And then this is for Dr. Wander Dorset. When we get to Scylla, she's got something for me to do. There's a faction quest here. So a UDL gunship has crashed on Monarch and both MSI and the Iconoclast desperately want it. Ret retrieve its targeting module. Okay. So that's one we can do back on Monarch. And then our companions still all have quests for us. So Nyoka, we did some stuff for her. And so we've got one for her back in the Emerald Vale, it looks like. And then Max has one for us on Scylla. Because we did part of his too. We're all about um, tracking down him being able to translate his book. That will lead to his... It's, that's a key to his enlightenment. Um, so a bunch of different things when we get to Scylla. Whenever that takes us there. And then Par Parvati wants a drink at the groundbreaker so we'll have to get there at some point and then we got a task here oh yes so this was lilia hagen this is also back in groundbreaker so we could do that at some point we have all these completed and apparently none botched so far um so for the moment i do want to clean all these up but for the moment let's go ahead for the purpose of this episode and let's continue on the main quest a little bit. And maybe once we make a little progress on this, we'll spend a couple episodes going back and cleaning up some of these side quests. Because I always like doing that as I go along with the main quest. One is I really want to prolong the length of this game. I'm in no hurry to be done. But also I find it just really helps equip me and makes me more and more prepared to get through the main mission. Anyway, so yeah, let's continue on that. We need to go... For the city and the stars, we need to go to Byzantium, which should be pretty cool too. So let's go do that. So we got to get back on our ship. We've got the shrink ray. <laughs> I'm good to go. Not a whole lot of stuff to steal here. Dude didn't leave much around, except that one canid thing. All right. Head on back to our lovely ship, the Unreliable. All right. A so, to all crew members, there is only one toilet on the ship. <laughs> One's enough for five humanoids. All right, let's put that away. We don't want to shrink Ada or shrink our ship. Welcome back, Captain. I haven't talked to her I've for a while. I've a transmission from Roseway from a Dr. Shaw. Beginning playback now. What? Oh, is this on? Oh, it's on right now. Oh, blast. Hello? I'm trying to reach the captain of the Unreliable. He's the one I got the force weapon this from. short, lest I get caught. Please return to Roseway as soon as you can. I have an item of great value that you'll be interested in. Oh, that's very compelling. Now, how do I... How does this blasted thing turn off? Damn, engineers never label these toggles clearly. Is it the... The transmission is complete, Captain. Okay. 
Um, so we'll talk to her some more later. <laughs> Raleigh has subscribed yet again with Twitch Prime. Look at those gorillas shaking their pecs. Woohoo! More weapons of doom. Should we go get that? We can go get that. It's either that or go to like the, uh, oops, to the uh, rich people's colony, May continue on with the main you. mission. We have two course, other things to do on Roseway, though. Sure you are aware, luck does not exist. But it seems to comfort humans to believe they possess good quantities of it. <laughs> More weapons of doom. Yeah, buddy. Did you see the uh, shrink ray? We have decided to continue supporting the outlaw scientist, Dr. Phineas Wells. Yes. That's his place. I just visited him. Dr. Phineas, I saw you were busy playing World of Warcraft to Raleigh. You're up late. You must have them tomorrow off or something. I do too. <laughs> so, yeah, okay. Let's go back to Roseway at this point and go get that weapon. Because we can use it in Byzantium. I'm a little tired right now anyway. We might want to save Byzantium till tomorrow morning. Because I have a feeling that's going to be a very cool place. You do not. Oh, you're just staying up late. Or I guess you don't open tomorrow. At the very least. We got, so we got a bunch of missions on Scylla. But for now, we're going to go to Terra. To the Roseway landing pad. And we have at least three missions Another now. Roseway, we could finish there. And then next episode, just to prolong it. To draw it out. Then we'll go to Byzantium. All right, so... Uh, let's go ahead and let's just go do it. So we'll stick uh, with these two nincompoops, Sam and Felix. I'm not sure all what they can do yet, but uh, we might as well go try them out. Uh, especially since we're not on supernova mode. Next playthrough, we'll do on supernova mode. And in that one, the companions can actually die. So yeah. All right, we got our two noobs with us, Felix and Sam, neither of which we have tried out yet. Okay, so let's just check what we got to do here. We need, we just got this thing from, all right, not that one. That's Roseway. That's Roseway. And what was the one we just got from Dude? Well, we know where he is. That wasn't Vaughn, was it? Alright, we'll put it on that one. Let's go over here. We'll see if these guys have... respawned yet. And I need to do some salvaging, because I'm broke. I spent all my money... on tinkering my weapons. Get some mag picks. All the things. Loot. Vending machines that stuff I can't afford yet. All right, let's go see who's over here. You're gonna fall asleep to the calming tones of the monkey puzzle. I'll make sure to be as frenetic as possible. <laughs> Keep your dreams lively. Yeah, I got the place to myself tonight, so I'm streaming a little later than I normally would on a Sunday night. Uh, but I'm still going to stream tomorrow, too. I almost backed down from it today because I'm tired, but i like, you know what? Warning. Ooh. Well, well, warning. Guys having problems. Yes. Nothing but gaming ahead of me. After five days of very hard work. Oh, I just got one of those lab outfits. I'm getting more aware at this point of the outfits of what they do so like this outfit would give you plus five tech skills there was some welding goggles i'd gotten way back that um i thought well these don't give you armor what good are they but i missed the fact that they gave you uh plus f excuse me plus 15 engineering 
So a lot of stuff, a lot of the outfits really can boost your skills. Oh, which is pretty cool. Alright, so is this the bad guy? Now he's got a name. Who are you? I done had enough of this shit. I'm just the <laughs> fucking tarmac guard. No one said nothing about fighting no raps. Yeah, so we've been here before. This is Auntie Cleo's. She makes like drugs and consumables and stuff like that. I was here to answer a distress call. Yeah, which I dealt with, but uh they're not attacking me now, so this place is friendly. Um <laughs> they pay you to whine, or do you just do that for free? <laughs> <laughs> the snarky playthrough will be the next one. This is the straightforward guy. Uh, what happened here? Alarms went off, raps broke loose, and I hightailed it in here to get a wall between me and them beasts. Um, I talked to the guy in charge. What do you think of him? Yeah, I ain't gonna make no comment on anything like that. No, no, no. And... You said the raps broke loose. Did you have them caged up? Um, forget I said anything about that. Okay. <laughs> All right. I'm just going to take a look around. Oh, before I forget, Auntie Cleo's makes the best pharmaceuticals in Halcyon. Better than nature. Not like that crap spacer's choice pedals. Better than nature. That's her tagline. And we won't deal with him right there. All right, so let me see. The dude who called me, who gave me that weapon before, he gave me this one, the ultimatum, which is starting to get a little under leveled now, but I did a lot of work with. Uh, he's right here. Orson Shaw. Let's talk to him. Ah, I remember you. You must have received my wireless. Thank the law. I went to great risk to send that. I did. And what did you mean by an item of great value? Aha. Uh -huh. I knew that it enticed you to return to our dangerously unprofitable township. I asked you here because I have a working prototype of the Alti nature, Auntie Cleo's Alti -nature. very first weapon. I'd like you to have it before it gets confiscated. Thank you for thinking of me. And I could just jump right down to, hey, you don't have to tell me twice, thanks. Um, but let's say confiscated, why? The schematics you fetched for me lent themselves well to the creation of the beauty you now possess. Unfortunately, anti Cleo R&D felt otherwise. The market's already saturated, they said. Weapons are I can't everywhere. wait to look at what he gave me. They aren't interested in mass producing the Alti nature, which makes this an illegal prototype weapon. Oh. Given your unlawful proclivities, I thought it'd be safest with you. Mm -hmm. So here we are. I'd rather see it in the hands of a free agent than destroyed. Good choice. Good choice. Uh, I'll say sorry to hear that. I'll be sure to put it to good illegal use. <laughs> added the word illegal. What did he give me? Oh, look at that. It's pink. It's a handgun. It only does 50 damage. It's only a level 11. So we'll have to level it up. But it's looking like that, but pink. It doesn't have... Oh, it's corrosion. Nice. Okay, so when we get a little money, we'll level this up to our level and see what it does. But I have a feeling it's going to be pretty good. Fantastic. Okay, let's put it over by that one. These guys like to hang out together. Sweet. And this one actually qualifies as a unique weapon. It's got that little fancy thing behind it. Nice. Okay, so while we're here, let's clean up. Let's finish these other missions. We're going to go speak with Vaughn. This was the guy who was doing the thing with the Raptodon Musk, and I thought I'd messed up the experiment, but apparently it had just broken off into this little side mission. Uh, head on back to Vaughn, let him know this experiment's been dealt with. You destroyed the experiment, but in the process released some Rapidons. That was almost certainly not the intended result. <laughs> Can we shrink him? Not the bad guys here at this point. 
At least you're not aggressive to me. Can I shrink the chicken? Will these guys be mad? <laughs> Ooh, that had to hurt. <laughs> Killed him. <laughs> Nobody cared though. <laughs> Alright, it does some damage too. Apparently. Alright, Vaughn. Sorry I goofed your experiment. Any news? On the thing we spoke about? You know, that thing? I found... Oh, wait. Before that, I had a question. Sure, I don't know what it is. But I have one, apparently. Uh, what's your company doing here, anyway? Ask Dr. Crane. All I know is my bit, analyzing the raptodon equivalent of hormones. Mostly they're leptin analogs. Raptodons have four different varieties. Oh, leptin analogs, based on the right. Of course. All right. Um. Oh, let's use some science. Science 25. Leptin regulates hunger. Designer appetite suppressants, then, maybe. Yeah, we already heard about the um, the diet toothpaste. Maybe it's for them fat cats up in Byzantium. Oh, Felix said something. Yeah, okay. Um. <laughs> Roseway seems pretty run down. It was like that when we got here. I heard it had been shut down for years. But the toilet's flush and the roof doesn't leak. Much. Hopefully that's the roof and not the toilets. <laughs> um, okay. Enough talk? Enough talk. Did we finish that? No? We're not done. Okay, we still gotta speak with Vaughn. Alright. More talk. Any news? On the thing we spoke about? You know... That thing? I found your experiment. Don't keep me in suspense. Did you get my stuff? I mean, not mine. It's for other parties. Buyers. I chose the wrong option, dude. Ah. Uh, we could lie. Or we could say what actually happened. <laughs> I don't know which one will get us to the right thing. See, the place was trashed. The Raptodons were all over. Uh, let's lie. Damn. I bet the outlaws shot it for kicks. At least the short circuit would have let some raptodons out. Revenge. Kinda. Yeah, it wasn't my fault. Hold up. Why did the raptodons get out? That didn't make any sense. I siphoned power from the pods to keep Dr. Crane from catching on. I'm no electrician. Every time I plugged it in, the locks would open. Hmm, that nearly got me killed. Well, it's not like I expected this to happen. Oh, and we got kicked out. Oh, the reputation decreased. What? Even after my nice lie and everything? Okay. Dang. Let's look at my uh, reputation. Anti Cleo. Positive 60% neutral. Negative 16%. So, uh, yeah. Well, that means nothing. <laughs> All right, so we knocked that mission out, apparently. Yeah, I had a choice of a continuing the experiment or injecting the sample. I thought I was supposed to eject the sample, but I should have continued the experiment. So let that be a lesson to you guys if you ever play this. Continue the experiment when you get there. All right, anyway, and we had one other one here. It was this one, buy his bootstraps. Anton sent Jameson to Auntie Cleo's old anti antibiotics lab. Just down the road south of Roseway, make sure he isn't wrapped in on Chow. Okay, so we gotta go find Jameson. And then we'll have done all the things in this place. Apparently. Okay. Alright. And how are we doing for money now? We... Got up to 3,808 from nothing, so that's pretty good. Um, Best way to win a game is by getting the What was my way out of here? This way. Can 
Got my little shrink ray out. Hundred and fourteen meters. Come on, guys. Now, if we get some combat, we'll get to see what these guys can do. Oh, here we go. Sorry, this Felix. Oh, Felix does a drop kick. Look at him go. And then Sam. Oh, well, look at him. Come boom. All right. Wish granted. Got to see what those guys can do. Where are you going? Some bad guys over here? Wait for me. I will shrink him. Hold on, hold on. Don't kill him yet. Oh, now get him. <laughs> Shrink him, boot him, kick him, rock him, sock him, robot. I like the drop kick. That was pretty fun. Alrighty. So where are we supposed to go in here? 15 meters that way. There's Jameson. What's up? Where are you, Jameson? All the things. Hey, look, my kind of door. What's your kind of door, Felix? Do, do, do. Take all the things. Unexpected. Everybody's dead. Oh, wait, somebody a shrink. Get him. Out of my way. <laughs> He grew pretty fast. All right, robot, get him. All right, let's use a real weapon now. I just upgraded this assault rifle. So we gotta see what it does. And that works too. This is great. My lock picking is so advanced now that it's going to take me zero. I still have to pick it, but it's going to take me zero of those mag picks to get in here. And I can see what's in here before I even do it. It's all in the wrist. All right. Take all the things. Purple berry crunch. Yes. Take it. Reno's mag picks, um, but this is, doesn't get me up to. Dude, maybe this does. All right, we're on this level. Yes, we want to go up there. Oh, well, we got lots of places to go. All right, before we go to where we're supposed to go, let's go to the other place. Oh no, we don't want to go back to Rosemary Gardens. Back in here. Let's see. Standard troop helmet. We probably don't need it at this point. Energy drink and some Siggy Siggy butts. Use the terminal. Experimental notes. Objective. Uh, objective. Determine the maximum maximum amount of raptodon digestive acid that can be safely ingested by humans before adverse effects present themselves okay <laughs> and number two raptodon fluid ingestion test procedure proposed procedure slowly introduce increasing amounts of raptodon digestive acid into the evening meals of randomly selected workers and observe their overall health this is evil and number three, uh, Raptodon, Raptodon fluid ingestion test results. One uh, milliliter, 
Minor stomach pain and, and nausea, safe. Two milliliters, minor stomach pain, extreme nausea, safe. Three milliliters, major stomach pain, debilitating nausea, some vomiting, potentially unsafe in the workplace. <laughs> Four milliliters, temporary blindness, frequent vomiting, patient unable to describe pain, unsafe. Five milliliters, unable to record symptoms as patient died within the hour. Okay, experiment done. Was that all of it? Yes. Feeling irate? Try anti-cleos, narcholectic bars. Now with 3% real, CCN76. <laughs> okay. All right, uh, let me see. Can we find dude through here? Oh, here got to to kill. Get him. After the meat. Oh, another thing to kill. Can we do that again? Sure. Again and again and again. Tactical shotgun, nice. All right, more stuff to read. What about more stuff to loot? Precision, precision spectrum magnification mono lens. Splash resistant laboratory outfit. We'll take it all. All right, we gotta read the terminals. Messages from Anton Crane. We met him. Porter, according to my records, January 23rd is your birthday. As is protocol, please feel free to enjoy one 10 minute break. <laughs> parentheses, numero one. 10 minute break between your normally scheduled 3 o'clock and 4 o'clock patrol shifts. I sincerely hope that on this day you take a moment to enjoy the fresh air of Terra 2. Brought to you by the thorough kindness of Auntie Cleo. Man, they are so generous. Imagine that. Getting a 10 minute break on your birthday. Amazing. Alright, there was one little spot back here that we, we didn't check out yet. But let's go ahead and uh, hook up with Jameson. Who, of course, is not only dead, but decapitated <laughs> we got his ID cartridge at the very least uh, we get a little X for rescuing him uh, did could we have hurried and saved him potentially because it looks like we failed that I never really got a chance to rescue him Maybe I was too slow. I mean, I did fly to a couple planets before I came back and rescued him. So, yeah, that might have been timed. Uh -huh. All right, we got to go back and talk to Anton. Right, let's get in here. Take all that stuff. Bits. And there was one area this way we didn't check out yet. Oh, hello. Resistant to cleaning efforts. Not dead yet. Everyone all right? Just fine. All right, let's just make sure we check this place out entirely. Okay, we've been here. Yes. Okay. 
Oh. I'm gonna pick it. Might be good, some good things. Alright, that's the way back out. Every place clean. Alrighty, we got any junk on us? Let's sell it. Figure out the rest later. And transition. And throw cylin. Talk to our buddy Anton. 